Um, hi, today I'm going to do a quick video on um, skincare update. Um, I did that video with all of those. Um, I look weird today. Yeah, my makeup's not right. The, the light I have here is too bright. Oh well. Okay, a quick skincare update. And I'm not even looking at the camera. I am in trouble today. Okay, number one. Remember when I showed you all of the St. Ives products? Well, here's an update. I had just gotten the hand cream, the St. Ives Naturally Smooth Hand Cream. Now, people are having trouble finding this. This is what it looks like, and yes, it's backwards. People are having trouble finding this, but um, I think I found it at Walmart or Walgreens. Actually, it has to be one of those two places. I don't think it was. I know it wasn't Target. So, um, but if you cannot find it, it's completely reasonably priced on Amazon. So if you're doing an Amazon order anyway, and you want to try this, try it. Okay. What I'm going to tell you about it is, you know, I'm 52. So my hands are starting to show my age and that's not good. And sometimes your hands look way older than you are. Let me tell you, mine were looking, you know, Probably how they this should. stuff has made a tremendous difference. Now, I'm not going to give you a before and after because I don't have a before and after. But I'm telling you, my skin on my hands looks so much smoother and newer. And it says on here, um, dual action formula, something, 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 cellular skin renewal. So, I think it's really, really working. This stuff, it's the same stuff, but it's body lotion. It's again the naturally smooth, same thing. I think one reason that a lot of products don't work for me is because A, I'm impatient and B, I'm not committed. I have been committed to using this stuff every day and it is making a difference on the skin, on my legs and everything. Now, since my hands had such great cellular renewal that I can tell, I've been putting this uh, right here too. So I don't know, we'll see. But that's another great place to get cellular renewal, right? Because I've laid in the sun too much as a young person, and um, that your neck, chest area shows your age as well, so that's too bad, but can't do anything about it now. Okay, oh, then I tried another product that they make that I love. Now, I would love to have this um, genre, whatever you want to call it, in a body wash, but I don't know that they make it, but I found this. Everything is about moisturization. Now, because I live in Florida, I can go days without putting lotion on because your skin just doesn't feel like it needs it. Um, like um, when I lived in Dallas or Houston in the winter, oh, even though people say Houston's not cold, it gets stinking cold there compared to here. And there's ice a lot of times. And you just run your heat, run your heat, run your heat. And you would get so dry. So much more so in Dallas. Whoa. I was like an alligator all the years I lived in the Dallas area. Anyway, the point is, even though I don't feel like I need moisturization or lotion every day here in Florida, now that I've been doing it, it's making a difference. But I found this too. Triple, uh, triple butters, creamy coconut. It's just a body wash. Again, St. Ives. It's just a body wash called Triple Butters. And yes, it's winter, but oh my goodness, I love summer. And every time I use this, I smell the coconut and I think of summer and I'm happy. And it smells just like, it smells a lot like a pina colada. Had a few of those in my life. Not many, just a few. Okay, that seems to be my drink of choice um, when we're on a cruise. We always get, well, not every day, but once in a while in the afternoon, we get one umbrella drink. So that's what I get is that. Okay. Now, here's another St. Ives product. Scrub free exfoliating pad. Gently exfoliate for smooth, radiant okay. skin. Here it is. I was so excited about these. There's 60 in there. It was about $5, maybe six. It broke my skin out so bad. The past few weeks, I've just been, and I wouldn't accept that this was it. This was it. Because two days after I stopped using it, everything went away or started at least. You can't see, but it's bad. So <clears throat> in theory, I think these would be awesome. You might want to give them a try. Um, but 
it didn't work for my skin but everyone's different so I'm not knocking this product at all I think it's a great idea that's why I wanted to tell you about it now um, okay so that's my update now for another Holy Grail product Holy Grail to me means when you find something that you really think I'm sticking with this for years or a long time or just the fact that it's really really good okay now I have to preface this because in the past I've used okay I'm talking about razors I'm so cheap this is embarrassing I've been using those cheap razors the, the, the disposables but there's disposables and then there's disposables girl I've been using the ones why do I keep saying girl girl I've been using the ones that are so cheap like not Daisy the pink ones cheaper than that okay and every time I open a new one I cut my leg they don't shave good or anything and I said something one day to my husband, I don't know why, and he said, let me see what razor are you using? And he looked at it, he started cracking up because this is one blade, maybe two. He said, this is a nightmare. I wouldn't shave with this if it was the last razor on earth. What is wrong with you? So he starts telling me about his razor, and I'm like, well, those are so expensive. And I understand a man that has to shave using a very good razor on his face, but for legs, I was just always cheap. Okay. So I decided I'm gonna get I'm gonna get myself a nice razor. <laughs> nice razor. Oh, you know what I did use in the past? I had an Epilady. Loved it. Talk about permanently removing probably half of my leg, you know, half of the area that had hair before. It's never come back from using the Epilady consistently. One of these days I'm gonna get another one of those because they are awesome. They are painful but you get used to it and they're awesome and it works like a charm and if I use that again if I probably use that for six months or a year again I would probably never have to shave again that thing works I'm telling you even though it doesn't say that's part of the deal it does remove some of the hair permanently it never grows back okay so I on someone's recommendation online I decided to buy this razor it's called uh, the Schick Intuition Plus Renewing Moisture. Now, it doesn't have the thingy in it because um, <clears throat> I had to take it out because it was used up. I have a new one. This is the little, okay? I have it. I cannot get the stinking thing to, to go back on. I can't even get it out of here. It. I don't know what. I'm. Uh, maybe I'm, you know, not very smart, but this thing, I hated it every time I used it. When this is in there, it rocks back and forth, and you don't feel like you can control it at all. And this was expensive. Like, this was like $8.99 for this with one, and maybe there was a, no, I, yeah, I think there was a second one. This was in the package, I believe. So I thought, I'll try it. I, I, I hate it so bad, I haven't even, of course, I'm, you know, malfunctioning here. I can't get this in. I didn't like this razor. If you love it, that's great, but I didn't like it. So I got this razor in my birch box. I am in love. This is it. This is my Holy Grail razor. It's got one, two, three, four, probably five or six blades, which I didn't know that made a difference, but evidently it does. This is it. It's the Schick Hydro Silk. Oh my gosh, this stuff works. Love this. Here's the refills. It's, um, I don't have, I, I meant to say the package, but I didn't think I'd like it. So anyway, five refills in a box. I don't remember the price, medium. Um, loved this so much. This is a great, great razor. Schick Hydro Silk is um, the refills. It's great. It, my legs, oh my goodness, it, it made a huge, huge difference. My husband just drove in the driveway, and he's going to come in the front door, so I'm going to sign off now. So I hope this was a good little beauty update for you, and um, I guess I'll talk to you later. Bye.